viewers, you are welcome to the Lord TV, your number one fantastic reality TV that gives you all that it takes to be enlightened on trending news, such as politics, entertainment, sports, and what have you. If you are new on this channel, kindly click on the subscribe button as well as already subscribed. So please don't forget to drop your comments anytime I drop new videos. Thank you. Ciao, ciao. Viewers, we have another beautiful trending news for you today. And the headline is Tension in Abia over abduction of travelers by suspected Fulani gunmen. But before I proceed, don't forget to click on the red subscribe button and the bell button to get updated anytime I upload new video. Thank you. The news in details. Ene Okun, Abia State Commissioner of Police, Umuahia. There is palpable tension and apprehension in Isupuk Atu local government area of Abia State over the abduction of travelers by gunmen suspected to be Fulani headsmen. The incidents occurred Tuesday evening around 7 p.m. According to a local source, some strange-looking men suspected to be Fulani were sighted in the bush around Onwaku area of the local government area and confronted by the locals. They were said to have left the vicinity and moved toward the Guli after the Abia State University on the road toward Isikwato town. The source said the strangers later waylaid travelers around the Guli erosion site in the road. They were said to have escaped into the bush after a confrontation with the police, abducting about four commuters. The source said the suspect had already abducted some commuters before engaging in a gun duel with the police. They finally escaped with their victims. The source said when contacted, the Transition Committee Chairman of the Council, Mr. Osita Ibe, said it was a case of suspected kidnapped being based on the briefing by the police, but added that the matters were still under investigation. He said that all the security agencies are intensifying efforts to apprehend the fleeing abductors and rescue the tico victims. When contacted, the police public relations officer in the state, Mr. Geoffrey Obona, said he would make inquiries and get back to our correspondents. He later called and said it was a suspected robbery case by bandits, confirming that a Toyota Yaris car was recovered by the scene. He equally noted that the occupants of the car were nowhere to be found and were believed to have been abducted by the suspected bandits. The PPRO said policemen and army personnel were later drafted to the scene to comb the bush and for the rescue of the victims. He, however, said he was not aware of the alleged sighting of strange men in military camouflage at Onwaku community. Thank you for listening to this news. Viewers, this is time for the Abia State Commissioner, Ene Okun, to prove himself. This is the time for him to demonstrate what his duty or what is called duty calls. This is what his own duty calls him to do and not to, demonstra not to demonstrate strength and power at Namdekanu's parents burial. This is what 
he should demonst- he should focus on this is what we are, we are talking about that is responsibility supposed to place more focus on and not placing focus on issues that that don't don't doesn't too much too much to that doesn't too much concern him that i believe the youth of the community can handle inspector buna i will say that you should start right now by showing your power to this type of criminal cases and not the civil matters like the one of IPOP leaders' parents, burial, where you deploy thousands of policemen to go and harass civilians without firearms. Can you imagine? Look at the numbers, the, the, the quantity of policemen you deployed on people without any firearm. Let's see the, the quantity and numbers of policemen we are going to deploy in this case. Let's see how far you and them will go. Because this is where you really need deployment of officers. And this is where you, ex- Commissioner Okum, is expected to stand up from that seat of yours and make sure that these perpetrators of this crime, these people that kidnap innocent Abians, are caught, and those that were kidnapped, you make sure they are brought back it is no longer an excuse this is something that i know fully well that even the youth of abias can even handle by making sure that they comb the whole of that bush find the Fulani headsmen and make get rid of them. Mr. Geoffrey Ogbunna should also make move because this is where he's expected to, to uh, demonstrate his intelligence. So, Generally, I will say that insecurity in Nigeria is now something that everyone needs to put focus and eyes upon. Because anywhere we are is no longer secured. Yes, because they have seen Nigeria as a place where anybody can gain free entry and free exit a place where anybody can come in without anybody questioning them and we claim to ba- to have embassy we claim to have borders we claim to have securities What are their functions and use? So, Nigerians, I would advise you not to put your hope in any of these things. But try and make sure that you try and play safe by securing yourself and your family and your property. You secure yourself and don't put your hope on this kind of security we have in Nigeria. 
Secure yourself relies on the kind of place that you go to. The kind of friends that you keep. Places you visit. And the kind of vehicle that you enter. Don't make unnecessary moves or promises that will warrant your leaving your present place to somewhere that is not expected, expected of you. The same thing goes to your children. They need lots of enlightenment concerning the friends that they keep. So Nigerians, I advise as a Nigerian as well. This, because these are the little areas I know that this inus crime can come in. Make sure you don't find yourself alone in the bush. So, anywhere you go, you need to be conscious of anywhere you go. Anything, anywhere you stand. And anything you do. At anywhere. At any place in time. This is my humble opinion. I don't know what your own comment may be concerning this news, but please don't forget. Don't forget to leave them behind. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell button to receive new updates. Thank you.